guys, Linux Master Race here, back again with another video. Today, uh, this will be part one of part two on the uh, the tool Easy Sploit. Um, so we'll get right into it. Uh, this video, I'll be showing you how to download it, how to install it, how to open it, and just a little bit about it and what it will do, and then. In the next video, part two, I will be showing you guys how to use it and how to use MeterPreter. So here's the GitHub repository. Link will be in the description. As always, we'll copy it and then we'll clone it to our desktop with the rest of our tools that we use very often. Oh, I forgot to clone. And it will clone it to the desktop. Alright, so let's list that out. Easy Sploit is right there. So let's go change our directory into Easy Sploit. LS to list. And there you go. There's the README file. And there's the installer. So let's check out the README for right now. Let's use gedit and then README. Expand that a little bit. All right, there we go. So these are reverse TCP payloads. Um, yeah, tomorrow I'll be going more in depth about that. This video is just showing you how to install. Uh, yeah, clone it, install it, and get it running. You can use them for Windows, Android. You can actually use them on Linux for a Linux distribution. Uh, that's pretty useful. That's that's actually awesome. Uh, Mac OS. I have not have not tried that before. Um, Maybe we can try that tomorrow with my MacBook that I have. Uh, web, don't ask me what that means. I really don't know. I, I, I really don't know. Um, exploit Windows 2007, or Windows 8 and 2000, wow, Jesus. Windows 7 and 2008, 64-bit only. 64-bit, um, I know that just by x64. If it were 32-bit, it would say x86 instead of x64. Um, exploit Vista XP 2000 2003 uh, and exploit Windows with a link. Um, and you can contact him um, in 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 the uh, the terminal. It, if you type in 10, it will show up with his accounts. So there's how we install it. We already did the installation the the cloning of the repository we uh, changed our directory into easy easy sploit we won't you be using bash installer um, type anywhere in your terminal to start easy sploit that's really nice too because a lot of tools you have to change your directories into them but as soon as you open your terminal you type easy sploit and it will start it um, a couple video tutorials come with it uh, if you want to check those out, I'm sure they would be helpful. And you can support them on Patreon. Um, Cali Linux Tricks is the creator of this tool. And they have a couple other tools, and they also have a YouTube channel. You should go check them out. I'll try and find them and link them in the description also. So, let's get right into it. So first we're going to need to change the permissions of this installer.sh file and little trick in Linux for you beginners if you type in just the first two or first three or first letter um, of something in the ter in the terminal uh, it will complete it for you if you're wondering how it's how it's typing it for me so I just type I n and obviously I n is the Installer IH or installer SH is the only file in there that starts with IN. So that's very nice, very handy. 
change the permissions, list them again, should be, yep, should be green. And now we will run the installer. Installation completed. I already had this downloaded. Um, I deleted it. So I just, I just wanted to show you guys how to download it. So now even I'll show you that it works even when you're not in the directory. Sorry for my typing. Easy sploit right here. It's awesome. Created by Kali Linux Tricks. Again, YouTube will be in there in the description. There's the link actually right there. Nice. I'll just copy that. And I'll just make a new file. Whoa. That's big. I always like to use camel case for file names. I don't like the look of spaces. All right, so here it is. Um, so again, we have a Windows payload in listener, so that will be reverse TCP payload. Um, basically, it uses meter preter and a reverse shell on their command line, I'm pretty sure. Uh, and um, yeah, tomorrow I'll be going into that video. I don't want to give too much away right now. Um, so Windows, Android, Linux, which again is is very awesome. That's that's sweet. Mac OS, which is also awesome because there's a lot of those normies out there that use Mac. And I am gonna say this: I hate, I hate, hate Mac OS. It's I hate it. I don't know. I hate it more than Windows, so, yeah, yeah, um, and you can also exploit these, these right here, these OS's, so, yeah, that's that video, I'm trying to keep it short, because if it was one video, it would be a very long video, and I like keeping it short for you guys, so there's not too much to watch and listen to in the same video. So I'll probably make that video tomorrow. If it's not tomorrow, it'll definitely be the next day. So stay tuned, subscribe, like the video, and check out my other ones. Uh, I have a playlist on Kali Linux tools. That's basically all the videos besides my proxy, proxy chains video right now. So see you guys in the next one.